Hi, I'm Nikki Butler. I'm a skin and scar specialist. And in this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about the wonders of radio frequency microneedling and whether radio frequency microneedling works. So the short answer is yes, absolutely. It is an incredible treatment. And in this video, I'm gonna to talk to you about what radio frequency microneedling is and some of the benefits that you can achieve from it. So I'm a huge fan of treatments that get your skin to work really well for you. So radio frequency microneedling is in essence a collagen induction treatment. So I'm gonna talk a bit about the, the uh, microneedling element and then we'll talk about the introduction of the radio frequency and why that's so powerful. So microneedling in all forms is collagen induction. So that involves tiny needles going into the skin and causing tiny little micro channels. Your skin's natural response to a minor controlled trauma, which is what the treatment is, is to produce fresh collagen and elastin in order to repair your skin. So you can't see the tiny little micro punches in your skin, but they are absolutely there. So your skin is busy repairing and regenerating, and the side effect of that, if you like, is a real boost in collagen and elastin, which means you get a plumper, more youthful looking glow to your skin. With radio frequency microneedling, when the needles are in the skin, radio frequency, which is a thermal trauma, it's heat, is introduced into the skin when those needles are at depth. What this does is it's a, an ultimate boost of collagen, so it's, it's creating even more collagen and improving the quality of the collagen that's being produced as part of the thermal trauma, and your skin's response to that is to tighten and lift. So you get a multitude of benefits with radio frequency microneedling. You get lots of the classic pesky signs of aging that are treated, so lines and wrinkles are improved, skin tone and texture. I've seen a really good improvement with my clients with, um, with sun damage as well. So microneedling hasn't traditionally been an amazing treatment for pigmentation and sun damage, but radio frequency microneedling really does seem to target that as well. Um, tightening and lifting of the skin, so fantastic if you've got um, skin laxity, things like uh, saggy jowls, turkey neck, um, absolutely powerful because you've got the double whammy of the collagen induction from the microneedling and the introduction of thermal trauma from radio frequency. So if you're looking for a non-surgical facelift treatment, this is one of them. It actually, I always say its best friend is HIFU, which is high intensity focused ultrasound, and I'll talk about that in another video. But ultimately they are collagen induction and um, ultimate skin rejuvenation treatments that come under the banner of non-surgical facelift. So radio frequency microneedling is also something I use a lot in my scar work. So I'm a scar specialist and I've used many different forms of microneedling over the years. Uh, and I will just say here, it's slightly different than the type of microneedling that you might see in beauty salons and um, with things like a skin pen. So the medical type of microneedling that I've used for scars is, is very, very different from that. Um, but uh, coupling that with radio frequency microneedling is enabling me to flatten out scars or scars that are sunken, it helps to raise them, really is boosting the quality of the skin and breaking down the scar tissue. It's great for stretch marks. Um, it is fantastic if you've got skin laxity, so uh, around the arms or the tummy. So if you've got that creepy kind of skin feel that many of us get as we mature, um, it's really, really good for tightening um, bingo rings, uh, and again, in conjunction with HIFU, and the same for tummies. HIFU and radio frequency microneedling target the skin at all the different layers and produce amazing results. Um, there is something that you will hear me say a lot and it's always, there isn't a one size fits all treatment. And what I mean by that is the number of treatments that you will require will be unique to you insofar as it depends on what your skin is like initially, your age, um, and the results that we're trying to achieve. So it will, with skin rejuvenation, it will always be a minimum of three treatments that take place around three to four weeks apart um, and up to six treatments. So I tend to find that my more mature clients might need four, five or six treatments. Um, but if you're on the, in the kind of like early 40s, you might find three treatments initially, then you move into maintenance. Um, and the reason we need maintenance treatments is because sadly, I can't stop the signs of the, the natural aging process. We can slow that down, we can reverse that slightly with treatments, but we can't stop the skin aging. So maintenance for most people is two to four times a year, just to keep boosting that collagen and to work on the results that we have already got. If we're using radiofrequency microneedling for scar work, 
That is, I tend to use that in conjunction with another form of medical microneedling, and that enables me to get really good results with leveling out the skin and breaking down scar tissue, but also boosting melanin to help the skin return to natural skin tone. So typically, and also typically, a course of five to eight treatments that take place four to six weeks apart is required for that. But again, everybody's skin is different. So it's very much about us working together to assess where you are at the beginning and the desired results that you'd like to achieve. So I hope that kind of answers uh, a little bit about what radio frequency microneedling is. What I am gonna answer this uh, frequently asked question, which is, does it hurt? Um, the honest answer is yes. It makes my eyes water when I do it on my face. I say it's a, it's a little bit spicy in terms of a treatment. It is needles going into the skin. For most people, it's completely bearable. Um, you can apply uh, a lidocaine numbing cream called Emla, which you can buy from most pharmacies for about five pounds for a small tube. You can apply that around an hour before you come to me, which will make your treatment much more bearable. But if you forget, and many of my clients do, it is still tolerable. Um, but I'm always really honest about treatments because I would hate to say to you, you'll be absolutely fine, you won't feel anything. The reality is it's needles going into the skin. So if you'd like to find out more about the treatment, you can go onto my website, depending on whether or not you would like to have your scars treated or your skin treated, you would just click on the option for your scar or your skin. It will take you through some very brief questions to make sure you get to the right part of the website. And there you'll have an opportunity to book a complimentary Zoom consultation with me. And I very much look forward to hearing from you.